Everyone that is um, commenting harshly on this video that has surfaced of me pushing this older woman. I would just like to first of all say that I apologize to this woman and I did not mean to push her that hard. She was informed beforehand to not get in the way of the performer and not to get on stage while we are doing our thing and performing. She did anyway. She got in the way of me while I was performing and I meant to just push her out of the way, but I ended up shoving her. I apologized to her. We took photos after. She is fine. She had a great time. She got two bottles per second to go home with. She had a fabulous time. We took pictures together. We keep keyed. And I felt horribly for it. And honestly, like I, it, like it ate me up that entire night. And now the fact that friends, like people that I know well, have decided to come for me this hard, like literally when I just had your back the other f***ing day when you got canceled from a gig and now you're gonna say you, uh, you would never ha hire me for a goddamn gig? Bitch, I don't need your gig, bye. So, once again, I apologize to her. Like with my whole heart and sincerely. If she ever sees this, I apologize to you because I should not have ever pushed you that hard and I'm not against violence. I'm not with for violence, I'm not. Um, for like abusing a woman that's never been my character and nor does that reflect my character okay and I really am like I don't feel like I should have to post this video but I just feel so bad about it okay so I apologize please leave me alone if you call yourself a friend to me okay Hi everyone, this is Deb. Welcome to the best channel on the internet. If you're new, please subscribe. And if you are already subscribed, please turn on notifications so you will always know when I upload. Also, you can follow me on all social media at code Deb YT. Now, let's get into the T. So, is drag a contact sport? Well, we learned on RuPaul's Drag Race Season 3 that it is not a contact sport and it is enough to get you sent home from the competition. However, it is also not enough to keep you from being invited back for a series of all-stars, even though the person that you picked up and tossed around was not invited back for that season. However, that person may be invited back for a future season. Spoiler alert, keep your eyes peeled for India Farah on an upcoming season of RuPaul's Drag Race all-stars now back to the current situation this queen was performing when a uh, allegedly drunken person got up in their way from what we are hearing in the comments from the queen the person was warned not to get up on stage but they did and the queen pushed her but she said she did it way too hard and she apologized and they all made amends at the end and took pictures one thing i think everybody can agree on is that the woman did not need to be sent home with two bottles of prosecco i think she had had enough anyway how do you feel about this i personally have been to many many drag shows i've seen people get up act the fool however i've never seen anybody get knocked on their blank before so did this queen take it too hard or was she just in the middle of performing and the person was in her way and it was a safety issue? Also, where was security at the venue? Because if there had been adequate security, then security would have taken care of the woman, she would have been removed, and the queen could have just gone about and done her job because at the end of the day, performing, as much fun as it is, 
is a job and if you were at your job and somebody came up and got in your face and got in your way, management should be there to take care of it and get the person out of their way so you can go back to doing your job. That's my opinion. Let me know yours in the comments. Thanks for watching. My name is Deb. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe and leave me a comment.